everybody, welcome into your Talking Fitchburg headlines on this Monday, September 12th, 2022. Let it rain. Yeah, it's been raining nonstop. Feels like forever, doesn't it? We haven't had one of these lawn soakers in a long time. And uh, yeah, we've seen uh, a lot of rain and some places have seen some flooding. So we want to make sure you stay safe out there. But let's take a look at the weather and see where we're at. Uh, as far as uh, rain totals go, estimated uh, rainfall amounts as of this morning at 5 a.m. Uh, we're about in the two to four uh, inch range here in Fitchburg. Of course, there could be some locally uh, higher amounts uh, depending where you are exactly. Uh, but another uh, inch of rain uh, possible yet today, four to six inches of rain uh, uh, across southern Wisconsin has kind of been the uh, interesting uh, amount there, especially as you head uh, east towards Milwaukee. They've seen some more rain. So please be safe out there. Allow for extra time. The commute this morning was a little rough in places because of the rain. Uh, so uh, take your time, uh, check on those loved ones, and please don't drive through any flooded waters as we don't want anybody to uh, drown uh, at all uh, during uh, an event like this or any time. Uh, so we'll keep an eye on things, but uh, definitely check on the weather before you head out. All right, uh, other news. Uh, Sain Road construction begins today. Yes, it is actually happening today. The reconstruction of Sain Road in the city of Fitchburg uh, has begun. It starts today. This two-year uh, project will focus on improvements uh, to East Cheryl Parkway intersection with Sain Road this fall. And the fall construction includes new pavement and intersection improvements, minor utility work, traffic signals will be installed in 2023. Uh, during this work, East Cheryl Parkway will be closed on one side of the intersection at a time. Sain Road will be open uh, in one-way uh, traffic and detours will be posted. And in fact, I have that information for you on exactly what that looks like. So the detours here are as followed. East Cheryl Parkway will be closed for through traffic. Sain Road north of Lacey is closed to northbound through traffic. A detour using Lacey Road to Central Park Place is posted. Sain Road from southbound traffic is open. East Show Parkway is closed, though, to eastbound traffic at Sain Road. So left turns, not a, not happening there. Northbound onto Sain Road is prohibited. I saw it happen this morning when I was driving through. You can't do it. You're going to have to turn around. Don't do it. And then uh, we've got East Cheryl Parkway is closed. The westbound traffic between Lacey Road and Syen Road. A detour using Lacey Road and Central Park Place is posted. Traffic is open for westbound traffic west of Syen Road. This closure is planned to begin on Monday, September uh, 12th. Again, started today, and those are up. The barricades are up now. So please be safe and allow extra time as you're passing through the area. And if you are using the detour, please be safe. That's cutting through some neighborhoods there. I want everybody to stay safe, take your time, put all those phones down to distractions down. And uh, yes, just be safe, okay? Please, for me. Early fall hydrant flushing will be uh, starting uh, today. It's already wet out there, so easy enough for them to uh, do some of this. Uh, happening uh, today through Friday, September 30th. Flushing will occur Monday through Friday, 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. Due to the flushing, the water may be temporarily discolored. Discoloration can be cleared by opening your cold water tap to full flow for a few minutes. Please do laundry in the evening when the water is clear to avoid damage to clothing. And they're doing this a little bit earlier this year uh, because of some of that well maintenance. So uh, be on the lookout for that. Brain and Body Fitness, empowering communities through brain health education and support. This event uh, happening at the Fitchburg Senior Center. Health and edu uh, uh, sorry, built for, uh, from a passion from empowering community members to learn more about and promote their brain health. Uh, you have a chance uh, to learn more through this great program. Older adults gain access to education and hands-on tools for strengthening both physical and mental well-being. Fitchburg Senior Center will be offering a two-part series in collaboration with Brain and Health Body Fitness Program. People 50 and plus interested in learning ways to promote brain health and wellness are encouraged to enroll September 13th and 20th at 10.30 a.m. Visit the website fitcherwi.gov backslash senior center to get registered. And finally, the Fitchburg Public Library has their book club at the cafe coming up this week. It'll be on Wednesday, September 14th. Book club, uh, book club at the cafe is held uh, at the uh, held on the second Wednesday of each of the month at Bariks. Join us this month, starting at 6:30 p.m. Bariks is located at 5957 McKee Road. Have a great day, everybody.